Hi, and welcome to another Radan Video Tech Tip. In this tip, we'll look at another Radan 2012 R1 enhancement. This tip's feature shows the improvements to tags or micro joints, where the tag size and quantity can be tied to the profile size. And another feature we'll look at is the new option to add a tag to the end of a profile. So let's start by reviewing improvements to tags where the tag size and quantity can be tied to the profile size. To provide this capability, tag settings have been added to the Rules and Styles section within Radian's Auto Tooling. Let's review these new options in Radian. Notice the new dynamic tool list on the right, which is available for profiling machines as well as punches. Functionality reviewed in a video tip from our January newsletter. Within Auto Tooling in the Tags category, note that corner and midline tag sections are still the same as previous releases, but a new option is now available to use Rule and Style Tag Settings. This new option is available when configured for profiling and combination machines, so when this option is checked, you'll be using the corner and midline tag settings specified in the Rules and Styles dialog instead of corner and midline tag settings specified on this page. Notice all these options are grayed out now. So if we have a look at the Rules and Styles section of Auto Tooling now, notice the Leads tab is still located in the upper right portion of the dialog, which still lists the lead styles for rule. However, now there is also a quarter tags tab for listing quarter tag styles for rule and a midline tags tab with similar rules based styles for midline tagging. Specifying corner and midline tag settings in the rules and styles dialog allows you to use different corner and midline tag settings for profiles with different sizes. As an example, you could define the large internal rule to not use corner tags and instead use midline tags for these types of profiles along with these midline tag settings. The size of the tags are specified in the style definitions which are now split into corner and midline tag styles listed with the other styles in the lower left portion of the dialog. So per profile, you can specify not only the size of the tag, but whether you want them at all. A second new option provides the capability to add a single tag at the end of every profile, essentially adding a gap at the very end of the specified profiles. So now every rule has the option of including an end tag, and every lead style can have a specific tag size. Using Rule and Style Tag Settings allows you to add these profile end tags to profiles, optionally with midline and corner tags as well. The Tag at Profile End option means a tag is added at the end of the profile just before the lead endpoint. This could be at a corner or on an edge depending on the lead style used. The profile end tag size comes from the lead style used for the profile. So then with every style, the tag size is determined in the style definition, and with every style is the option for the tag at end of profile. Notice how some rules have tag at profile end checked, and others do not. So the benefits are that we now have options to control tag size by profile size through Auto Tooling's new rule and styles options as well as the additional option to add a tag to the end of a profile also handled through rules and styles. Thanks for viewing this Radan Video Tech Tip and stay tuned for more tips from the Radan Resource Newsletter.